Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. This is Brie from Brie Creates. I wanted to come back, of course, with another video to show you guys what I've been um, crafting recently. And um, yeah, just a craft haul, actually. It's a huge craft haul. Um, it's from various places. And I'll have links down below if you would like to purchase. Let's start with this one here. Y'all, can you see? It's the foil quill. And I got it for $40. If you guys don't know, um, this is like originally, it could go up from $100 to $64. I've seen it at various prices. However, right now, if you try to buy one of these pens, just one, like the pink one or the turquoise one, it's $40 by itself. So this was an awesome deal. I never really had um, a reason to buy it. However, I saw it for $40 and I knew it was a good price. And I did wanna try this out. Yes, I have been wanting to try out foiling and have it as an option for my customers because this is good for like, it's good for invitations. That's for me. For me, that's what I would mostly use it for, for like invitations. Um, and who doesn't like foiling, period? Like, it's beautiful. So, that's my first. Y'all, I never thought, oh no, where's my... I never thought that I would be um, attempting to uh, jump into the yarn and uh, knitting <laughs> realm of arts and crafts or crafting, but there's this um, there's this cute little rattle that I was wanting to purchase. And I'm like that meme that says, well, why buy it when you can make it? Or why buy it for, let's say, $10 when you can make it for $40? So that's me right now. <laughs> I have started to, and I'll put a picture. I'll put a picture up here to show you guys my inspiration. And it's a cute little rattle. I want to make it for my son. Yes. So yes, I have started my crocheting uh, path. I will let you guys know in a future, future video how my creation has come to fruition or not. But um, yeah, so I wanna put it in a, like a baby box for my son um, who's to come early next year. So, and yes, um, update, baby update. I am 20 weeks pregnant, yay! And we did find out it was a boy. So the next thing I bought was, oh, side note, this was from Joann's. The crocheting items, this hat, um, all from Joann's. And what I plan to do with this hat is actually put my last name, like Mrs. Kilpatrick, on it and yeah it was super cute I think I got it for like seven bucks oh, oh. A little sun hat I thought it was adorable I bought these I think I got like oh, I think I got like 200 or 300 and a lot of things that I um, mail out to my customers they're about this size Ooh, can't even see they're about this size a lot of them are like centerpieces or you know baby showers so I wanted it to, to look more professional and these absolutely do the job and all you do it's a, it's a little envelope I forgot what they actually call it I don't know what the actual name is but um yeah you just fold it over and look how cute now they sell these <gasps> at Hobby Lobby this here, I think I paid like $8 for like 200 or how many I bought. This is what they sell at Hobby Lobby. This is the brand, ooh, can't really see. This yeah. is the brand they sell. It's crystal clear bags. Yeah. 
Um, this size is four by six. And this size is four by six for 25 bags. Just for 25 bags, $3.99. So this is when it benefits you to like do research um, and not just buy just because it's convenient in a store. You're definitely spending a lot more money if you're buying them in the store. So um, now if you just need it like quickly, you don't really use these too much, then I can see you buying in the store. So that's not a big thing. But they have all types of sizes. All types of sizes. And this is actually in the section where um, it's like a painting section where like painters actually get their like easels and um their canvases it's like in that section at least at my hobby lobby it's not by the paper crafts it's not by anywhere that you would think that it would be by it's literally by the paints so they have this is like i think i think this one is the smallest they have the four by six but they get pretty huge so you can use it for a variety of projects my next thing is these little resealable sacks. It's it's just Ziploc. I haven't opened the office, obviously. But it's just these Ziploc ones. I think I'm gonna start um, making like confetti, personalized confetti. Um, so I bought these just so that they're housed in a, you know, in a cute little manner. So got these from I think I think I got these from Michaels. I think they're like $2.99, $3.99 for $150. That was a good deal. Now the next thing I got, which was a this purchase was not planned. And had it been planned, I would have I would have did more research and things like that so I had a huge project that I needed to get or I had a huge order per se I should say I had a huge order and I knew that glue like the glues that I have would not look good um, it just wouldn't look good so I knew that this was my next step getting a tape runner um i didn't get to do much background on any other tape runners because there's so many brands there's so many brands in store and then there's so many more brands online so this actually was like the cheapest in store i got it from michael's obviously because it um well i guess recollections is sold at hobby lobby too but i got this one at michael's because literally michael's is like across the street from where i live so, um, yeah, so I got it. I was able to do two, two and a half of the huge projects that I did. And then it ran out of tape. So I'm like, and it was the, the project I did was double sided. So I feel like it was, it was a good amount of tape. However, getting refills, I knew I had more time because at that point the projects were done so I was able to go on um, Amazon to see if they were off-brand uh, refills and I found I found some because in store it's like $13 the refill that's not feasible for projects it's, it's not feasible so I ended up getting so this is the original this is the original Recollections um, that came out here, the Re Recollections tape. So um, the brand that I got from Amazon is called Scrapbook Adhesives. Let me see. And I'll open this up so you guys can see. Oh, here it is. I don't want to take it out. But it fits perfectly. It fits perfectly. Um, I was pretty... I like this uh, tape runner. It wasn't too bad. I haven't tried any other tape runner, so I can't really compare it. I don't have anything to compare it to. So it did the job. Um, and 
brands. Yeah, because there's like Scotch brand and it's it was like 50 bucks. I was like, I just I can't see myself spending 50 bucks on a tape runner that I wasn't even expecting to buy. My next um, item are actually these are they hexagons? Let me see. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Yeah, hexagon. Are these hexagon like acrylic? Can you guys see? Let's see. What can I put against? So these little hexagon acrylic name plates or that's what I'm gonna use it for, basically. It's a name plate. Um, I actually purchased these before COVID hit or before this whole pandemic hit. And it was gonna be like something you use at fancy baby showers or weddings, Thanksgivings, any type of large get together and everybody would have their own personalized. It could even be like a coaster. Coaster or nameplate, you know? Um, so that's a cute little splurge I did. I had only got purchased a couple. I actually got these, I think, from Etsy. However, they're sold. They're sold on Amazon. Side note, if you guys ever want me to do like a tutorial on something specific, um, just leave it down in the comments because then I don't know what you guys want to see. Just like if you see anything up here, yeah, this is my uh, brother PE500. This is an embroidery machine. It's my Gullah Cricut heat press I have plenty of other things to show you guys um, oh and the last item I got from Amazon were these um, is this Teflon sheet the Teflon sheets I think there's four of them or it's a three pack actually it says three I think I got for $6.99 it was a really good deal um, I actually did a little tutorial using my um, these Teflon sheets and I did it in conjunction with uh, masks so I did like um, a little custom mask for my son and he actually helped me so if you guys haven't seen it definitely check that out but um yeah I'm done here this is pretty much what I've bought recently um, Thanks for watching. If you guys would like to see anything else, please leave it down in the comments. Like, share, subscribe, and yeah, see you guys in the next one.